God knows best. Our ways are not always his ways. Once there was a man who asked God for a flower and a butterfly. But God gave him a cactus. And a caterpillar. The man was sad because God didn't answer his prayer, and he didn't understand why. God has a lot to do and many people to care for. He trusted that God would give him what he needed and when he needed it just as he had done with the Hebrews in the desert. He planted the cactus and placed the caterpillar on it. In time he returned to the caterpillar and the cactus to see what God had made of them. To his surprise, from the thorny and ugly cactus God had grown beautiful flowers. And the unsightly caterpillar had been transformed into the most beautiful butterfly. The man had prayed for a flower and a butterfly and was disappointed when God gave him a cactus and a caterpillar. But the man never lost faith in God and trusted God to provide him with what he needed when he needed it. By giving the man a butterfly and a cactus God had also given him the opportunity to experience firsthand the simplicity and beauty of God's creation in action. This experience did not shake the man's faith but instead strengthened it. God's way is always the best way. Remember, today's thorn may be tomorrow's flower. Today's caterpillar may become the wings of faith that lifts you to heaven. For my thoughts are not your thoughts, neither are your ways my ways, says the Lord. For as the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways and my thoughts than your thoughts. Proverbs chapter 16 verse 9. A man's mind plans his way. But the Lord directs his steps.